podcast is not dead. So you really got 3,000 views on that video. Oh, what, the Insane Trilogy? Yeah. Eh, that's nothing. Was that episode one? I think it is episode one. And that was such excitement. How many subscribers did you get for it? Uh, I can't really say the word on subscribers, but I do know that recently, of last week, I've got like one or two subscriptions, so. That's good. Yeah. That's good. Shout out to those people. Shout out to the real ones that actually tune in and watch my stuff. You guys think you're better than me. <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps. <laughs> Perhaps. You guys always... Yeah. I'm probably going to take a nap after this. Us too. Yeah. Yeah. The full yeah. day. I had a nappy, yeah. The full day. Yeah. And then Thursday, Shaka Shaka. Shaka Shaka. I wish, I wish. Yeah, yeah. Fingers crossed. Like I said, it'd be an honor, but I gotta wait for that. So happy birthday in advance, in case I won't be here. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Yeah. Thirty-one. 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 Still blazing. Still blazing. Still blazing. I'm ballin', I'm ballin', I'm ballin' on you. I'm flossin', I'm flossin', I'm flossin' on you. Gas up, shoddy, set to the party. You want me to put your filly in the fridge? No, I'll, uh, I'll eat it later. Okay. It's cool. You want me to put it in the microwave? No, of course not. Dude. Dude, I'm in the Hot Meals program. Yeah, I know you are. It's like, don't you know what a, who I am? Don't you know who I am? I'm a gaming god! I'm sorry. But I gotta wash my feet. But did you get 6,500 eliminations in total? I didn't think so. No, no 6,500 eliminations? Yeah, what if I was put on trial for my crimes? The amount of murders I've committed? In video games? Yeah. Huh, you, you're fucked. Yeah. Grand Theft Auto alone, you're fucked. They'll, they'll, uh, they won't stop until I'm vapor, basically. Pita's all over your ass because you played Super Mario and you killed a bunch of turtles. Yeah. Did I really kill a bunch of those turtles? No, I, I killed a lot of those things. Could you imagine if I'm put on trial for the crimes I've committed? Specifically murders. I think I've killed like at least 10,000 people in video games. Wow. Yeah. So. Right. It's all on red mess, basically. Am I currently downloading something right now? Because, like, what if somebody calls me? Because lately I've been do not disturb. Something, something, something. That's my word. <sighs> that AC feels fucking great. I'm tripping, I'm tripping, I'm tripping on food. <laughs> I can't feel my face when I eat food. And I, I love it. it. <laughs> and I love it. I have to remove my legs or my legs. A limb or two. A limb or two, but I love it. <laughs> but I love it. Not on Keith's level, no way. No way. No way. I'm surprised that man's gaming. Me too, yeah. God, that would suck. The minute I'm on my 600 pound life, just put a bullet in me, please. Just end it all. Wow. I just can't, I just can't take That's it anymore. Dark. I just can't take it anymore. Do you want to open that for you? No, it's cool. I mean, while you're sitting like this between your legs. That's why they call him Lambda Clary. That's why they call you Third Leg Braham. Third Leg Braham. <laughs> Third Leg Braham. <laughs> Honey. It's a good size. <laughs> like I said, it's kind of like an absent father. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. You know, you don't oh, get man. you don't get your hose up and everything. <laughs> Life's questions: Does the Earth revolve around? Does the Sun revolve around the Earth? Are we truly alone in the universe? Did my father ever come back with the milk? <laughs> Sometimes you have to ask yourself the big questions in life. Do I really need all these games in my library?
Do I need all those games in my library? Yeah. I could go without a few of them. <coughs> Somebody you gotta keep the ones you paid for. Oh, yeah, I mean, obviously. Yeah. You gotta keep... The freeware, though, a lot of those you can get rid of. Sure. Yeah, a lot of the freeware you can get rid of. Some of these games are actually packing platinum trophies, you know that? Really? Yeah, there's well, some under the surface, yeah. Freeware. Yeah. Platinum. Yeah, there are ways to get platinums. Hmm. Granted, they're basically like this one game, I think it was like a Halloween, it's like Halloween puzzle or something like that. It's a, it's a free game, you can get a platinum on that, but you have to like memorize everything, like literally every every pattern. Really? Yeah, you got like three minutes to, you know, solve like, solve like, what was it, like, like 80 different patterns, like 80 different things. Oh yeah, it's, it's complicated, but if you can complete that on extra mode, I think you should get the platinum. Yeah, I didn't. I just uninstalled it. But yeah, I don't I blame don't... you for uninstalling that. Huh? I do not blame you for uninstalling that. Yeah, it's overwhelming. Yeah. And the, the worst part is, is that, like, the tiles from the memory tiles, they're all randomized. Oh, no. So they're in all different positions. So you're trying to find this, and then it's all the way over there. It's just, you know, it's, it's, it's really complicated. Okay. So a lot of these games, like the Palgi games... Okay. I've uh, I've done a few of those and gotten the platinums on those as well, but they're you know then again you know they're substantial platinums. Perhaps. Perhaps. Yeah, there are some platinums though that I kind of like wholeheartedly regret. Like I mean, I think I played Word Quest, which is like you know. You platinum the Word Quest? Yeah. Really. You only need like twelve levels. No, there was one called Rooftop Rascal, yeah. where you're playing as a cat, and if you jump like twenty times, you get the platinum. That's how easy it that's is. That's easy. That's it. That's all it really uh, took. It's like you jump twenty times, and that's just like platinum trophy. It's like. Wow. Yeah. I'm gonna put this a little closer. This way. It didn't take long. It didn't take longer than. Why should you fit it? So. Didn't take. Didn't take longer, but like a minute maybe. Yeah. At most. Yahoo! 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 I'm gonna miss the good old days where you say, hi, 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 yeah. Bless you, Thomas. Bless you, baby. Let me put it on airplane mode. So as far as internet cochinos go, I think I'm like at like maybe two gigabytes. Really? Yeah, so we got like at least like 14 other, 14 other gigabytes to kill. Cool. So. <clears throat> Can I, can I, so, can I, like, finally get into the bad news? What's going on? After 33 years, Game Informer shut them down. Fuck. Yeah. I actually respect their gaming journalism. Me too. Yeah. They were very informative. Freaking, you remember Game Enforcer? You don't remember that? You don't remember that special edition? Yeah. Game Enforcer, it's kind of like around Halloween time, where it's kind of like an April Fool's joke, but, like, for the whole thing, you mm -hmm. know? So they just, you know, do the ratings and all that other stuff, and those mm -hmm. weird, you know? They give you previews of like what's to come in a lot of games. I feel like the publication itself is probably going out of business because I mean, you know, all the video gameplay trailers and all that, all that's like on IGN and stuff like that. Yeah. I actually, I, I actually, uh, with my ex fiance, I actually played uh, the first thirty minutes of Final Fantasy VII Remake. Mm. That was beautiful. That was a lot of fun. We definitely enjoyed that. Of course, I bought the game, so I had that like on a. I had the deluxe, up the digital deluxe, so. You know. So. Cat Quest Three is coming out on Tuesday. Tuesday, okay. Which means I'm gonna have to. Head back home and, you know, try to. Let's <laughs> download it. No, try to beat it. Oh, right. Try to beat two to preparing for three. Yeah. Yeah. I like two because you know there's co-op available. Okay. So you know. Oh, is that why you wanted me to get it? The Cat Quest trilogy. Yeah. No, I, I mean I primarily wanted to get that for you because they're good games. They're all three oh. of them are good games. Oh. I thought you meant the co-op. Well, I think two does have co-op, and then three will have. Three. I assume three still has co-op. We assume. Yeah. 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 Assume it, yeah. The first one, obviously not, because that's, you know, that's single-player adventure, but then Cat Quest 2, you know, definitely. You got a cat and a dog. I prefer the dog, 
Really? Oh yeah. Why? Huh? Why? He hits hard plus his level his max level heal pop, like heals two hundred a pop. I guess one could be I guess one could be the physical attack or the other one could be like the healer. Which by the way is a thankless job in all of these Healers? Know, yeah. Healers, yeah, healers. Yeah, you know, healers are clutch. Yeah, support teams, support characters are like uh they're huge, you know. You know, a lot of uh teams on T Fortress too yeah. will go medic, 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 heavy, heavy, medic. And just Uber the heavies. Yeah. While uh they mow down everything else. Say like a five and a half. Five and a half what? Five and a half inches. Oh, your dick? Oh yeah. Okay. When you walked in that one day? Oh, okay. I think it was like five and a half. Okay. Yeah. Of course, if I lose weight, it'll probably be a lot larger. But how? How what? How would it be bigger? Just proper exercise. I mean, really, the only thing that's hiding, the only thing that's hiding it is my fupa. To get rid of that. What's a fupa? Fatty upper pubic area. Oh. Fupa. Yeah, if I lose if I lose that, you know, I obviously have more more uh, length than width. Well, what about your girth? What about my girth? You would lose your girth. That's probably for the best. I want to look like I'm at least somewhat attracted to some of these people, you know? Like, I don't know. It's like I just think it's sexy as hell. You're a single father. It's like, okay, but how's that gonna help me in the long run? In the grand scheme of things, how is that going to help me? How do I feel like that's going to be beneficial to me with that information? You, you go back and ask them, do you want to be a single mother? You know, I look at you, and every, and every day I think to myself, wow, you're going to be a great single mother one day. <laughs> <laughs> the same thing with Ray Romano when he, when he was talking about, like, oh, I saw Judd Apatow's comedy, and then I was like, and I said, someday they're really, you know, someday they're going to be a really good writer. <laughs> you know, a lot of these actors are not really, you know, these, these actors aren't really com comics. They're comedic actors. Mm -hmm. It's because the people that write, that write, write for them. That write for them. Yeah. Like Seinfeld. They're the real heroes. What, the people that write for them? The people that write for them. open that for you? Yeah, if you want to. Yeah. It's got my name on it, that's Billy. <laughs> Philly Makuchi. Phil McCavity. See, on Brazos, it's Phil Makuchi, and then on Trans Angels, it's Phil McCavity. I thought you deleted Trans Angels. I thought you deleted Trans Angels. I deleted videos. Like, five videos, that's it. What made you change your mind on five? Because it was on your iPad. Serena Valentina. <laughs> what made you decide to get five? Well, for her benefit, really. We shall not speak of it. Shall not. Shall not. Let me turn this fan on. Turn that shall, one off. I shall say the name no longer. I'm kidding. Do we drink the other drink? Sure. There's another <laughs> drink? Yeah. Now I'm confused. Oh. Got two cans. One for the smoke and one for the hoe. The hell? <laughs> I'm sorry, honey. I'm not I was that. trying to rhyme. No soup for you. No sorry, soup. honey. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't think of that until it came out my mouth. You know, the soup Nazi was actually. He did such a good. He played such a good part in Seinfeld. He got a. He got a cameo role in the Austin Powers movie. Really? Yeah, I think it was. What was it? The spy who was it? The spy who shagged me. Right. Who's spy who? Huh? Yeah, there's one. up here. Yeah. He played a uh, played a black track dealer. Oh, he did. Yeah. Okay. You want to put it on the floor over there? The soup not so. No soup for you. So the Philly, huh? The French. The Phil Macucci. The Philly. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Mm. Good 
good choice. Good choice. Oh. oh, I forgot to turn that off. What do you see? Stacy, can't you see? You're just not one for me. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm in love with Stacy McMahon. Stacy McMahon, she's got it going on. Stacy McMahon, she's got it going on. Huh. You remember that song? No. You don't remember that song? Larry, you remember that song? You don't fuck with Fountains of Wayne. She said, I don't know your music, kiddo. <laughs> Kelly doesn't know that Abraham and me go out to eat every Sunday. <laughs> you heard it over here? No, on the couch. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> wah, 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 wah. I kind of regret doing that. What? Never will I ever go down to one ever again. Until you know them. Yeah. Sure. Because I don't have any, like, no bumps or anything on my mouth or nothing. I hope not. Oh, let's hope not. Oh, God, that'd be horrible. It'd be terrible. That's for life, too. It is for life. Looking forward to dog pool. Dog pool? Dog pools and Deadpool and Wolverine. Really? Yeah. Nice. What's what with its tongue sticking out and everything? Mm hmm Good morning, sir. Yeah, I think he knows. He's saying yes, maybe that. <laughs> there you go, save it a little bit. We recycle here. Oh. We recycle in this community. Ugh. Has there ever been a good Superman video game? No. No, there has not. You know why? Because Superman is trash. Superman super F tier trash. What about the death and return of Superman? Is there Super Nintendo? It's su Superman sucks. Okay. He can do anything he wants. Unless stone. They love those green rocks, don't they? World's most lucrative element somehow is everywhere. The weakness is the sun. I thought that was his strength. No, I thought the sun itself. It was the sun of uh, Krypton. To allergic to vitamin D, or how does that work? The sun of Krypton is a lot stronger. Kryptonite. Yeah! Good tonight. Yeah, yeah. I should be my son. I should be my strong commander. If I was raising them. No wonder why they were called. No wonder why they called Clark Kent the son. Yeah! <laughs> At a uh, freaking CSI. Oh yeah! He just goes, he just goes. He just puts on the glass and he just drops like a really bad pun or whatever. Mm. Yeah. Please don't get on the couch. Yeah, 
say that? A scyther can't learn fly, but a whooper can learn ice punch. Huh? You had to say that. I'm not going to again. See, now she's embarrassed. Yeah. Embarrassed. 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 I gotta go meet uh I gotta go meet this girl at uh at Burger King at three PM on Thursday. Okay. She's kinda worried. This Burger King? The one in Chula Vista. Oh in Chula Vista. I bring all my quarters there. I get up and stuff. So that you guys can come here? Yeah. Yeah. Shock shock maybe. 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 Let's make love. Yeah, I guarantee you. Just a taste of that would be enough. Right. She'd want to stay. Okay. Believe me, she'd want to. Okay. So. Okay. Pretty confident. I'm not saying I'm confident. I'm just a giving lover. You know. Yeah. I'm a selfish lover. I'm selfless. Yeah. Yeah. I say no. I say I'm tired. My goldfish is drowning. That type of deal. How does a goldfish drown? They live underwater completely. By putting them in the air? Huh? By throwing them in the air. Oh? Mm, that's how they drown. They drown the opposite of us. She's really eating up. She's probably just going to throw up and I'm going to have to watch that. Daddy, help me. I don't feel good. That's what she's doing. Help me, Debbie. Oh, I'm so sorry, honey. You gotta cough it up here a little bit. Actually, as I was about to put groceries in my mom's house, mm -hmm. I think put and just went bleh, and just like, you know. Hairball? Yeah, just hairball, like mm. size of a log. Yeah, it does that, logs. Yeah. Yeah, logs. It looks like, like a food log. At the table, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, animals, well, animals can't help it, you know. No, I can't. But still, does. She promised she'll never leave me. <laughs> I really never do this. <laughs> I regret doing that. I'm dead serious. I did it for the first time in 20 years, 21 years, and you know what? I'm a master at the art of giving. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Pick you up, go eat out, and then head to Burger King. Yeah, that deal. Yeah. I'm not saying she gives me Stormy Gale vibes, but she kind of gives me Stormy Gale vibes, you know? Who? You know, Chicky Poo that I'm picking up on Thursday. Oh, Hermosa? Yeah, me and Hermosa, okay. yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what it is, something about that, something about that fine wine. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Yep. I don't know. This whole thing about body image, I don't really care about all that. You're not a body shamer? Of course not, no. Okay. All bodies are good bodies. Mm. Even you know, the trans ones? Especially the trans ones, are you kidding me? Okay. Dude, I saw Boy Meets Girl, and when I saw Michelle Hendley coming out of that lake, it's like, whoa. That makes all some type of way, you know. Okay. Yeah, it's you know it's just. I don't know. That's my line in the sand. All bodies are good bodies, and if you don't believe that, then you can hit the bricks, son. Hit the bricks or the showers. Or the showers. Arcade mode podcast. So, the podcast is not dead and gone. No, it's not. I, I really hope, I really thought it was. Why? Because the screen was cracked. I don't remember oh, how that happened. But like the Queen's Fortnite screen? It, it, it could have been, it could have been, you know, it could have been when it was dropped at Subway. Maybe, but it's not the case, though. Yeah, so, I don't know. Well, I was just like, hey, you know, one earthy, early birthday press it. Okay. That's like I said, because I wanted, like, I, like, I'm not really saying I, not really saying I'm cheap or anything like mm -hmm. that, but, you know, it's just, you know, it's, you know, well, if you got some use out of it, then that's... Fuck yeah, dude. Hundred something games? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sure it's worth. I was playing uh, Ruby. Oh? Yeah, I was 
Airplane movie. I gotta pick Robo. Yeah, Emerald was definitely the, my go-to one. That one was a lot of fun. Did love playing Emerald. I kind of gave up on getting a sea dog because I was like, oh, Lumber, you know, Lout has the same deal, you know, it's the same water and water and grass type, so it's, you know. The cat's way better. I should probably get back to playing Mega Man Battle Network. Oh, yeah? You, that's right. You love that game. Playing that whole, that complete series. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's just so much to do in like an hour's time, you know? Yeah. Because you only get like 60 minutes to record footage yeah. and everything. It's, yeah. you know, it's just a. Yeah. yeah. What if we took naps? Just in general? Or yeah. We could go to like at least an hour before we cut it, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, we'll do it that way. Yeah, what time are we have right now? Like 10 minutes? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We're not even 26 minutes and 25 seconds in. Okay. So, so a little over a minute. Though. Like 34, 35, something like that. 34, 35 minutes? We'll hit to like an hour and we'll just call, okay. it, we'll call it a session. Or then we'll take a nap as a group. Take a nap, maybe some shaka shaka. Oh. I'm an auditory type of guy. Like well, she was she was talking about her ass at one point in time, and I was just like, "Oh, yeah." I just don't want any distractions. That would suck if I bring her all the way over here, and then freaking dude picks her up in a red Mercedes again. That'd be hilarious. No, it won't. Yeah, I was like, I was just, I was just sitting there by my lonesome. It's like, hey, if I send you a picture of Bernie's tits, would you send us money? It's like, <laughs> that's so weird. I'll just send you. He's the such money. a weird guy, dude. I'll send you the money. He's such a weird guy, dude. I didn't even ask for money because I know what happened to him, you know. And uh, like I said, I'm the last person to, I'm the very last person to be asking any type of money from anyone, any type of compensation. I'm not really worried about it. I don't know. Hey, man. So they are together or they're not together? I don't know anymore, and honestly, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't care. I don't care either. Yeah, me neither. It doesn't matter to me. So if that person's Bernie, then what? <laughs> huh? So if that person's Bernie, then what? And you bringing her here? I'm not bringing her here, but I'm just saying, you know. Bernie's not allowed here. Why? Because she probably burned down my house. Or my cat. Oh yeah, that's probably not 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 safe. I don't trust her with small animals. I'm on Team Switzerland, so you weren't here. You weren't here when you were at the house in the backyard, right? Where it happened. So a cat, probably. Oh, the one that died. Yeah, a little bit larger than this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. A little bit larger than this one. Yeah. Imagine you got your ass beat so bad that you can't even let out the auditory, like, you know, the auditory, Ow. the the like, you know, the 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 hiss. You can't even hiss. That's yeah. how beat up you are. Yeah. Either that man lost his voice or something, because he was just like, as you go to like, you don't go. He was to on his dying breath. As you approach me, he just goes. <laughs> That's the weird part too. It's like you can't even let out a can't even let out a guttural hiss or like a meow just. Yeah, I died that day. Did it die that day? Did I even die that night? I might have died like the day after. Oh, that's pretty much yeah. the same thing. I died. What? I died. Yeah, you died. My uncle Fred, he uh, his one of his cats was eaten by a coyote. Oh no. Yeah. So. Those illegal smugglers. You damn coyotes! Yeah, but some of these dogs are really hardcore, though. Yeah, I bet. One of these dogs, I guess, you know, got jumped by, like, ten coyotes, and one of them ran away, but nine of them are all dead at his feet, and it's got, like, he's got, like, blood in his mouth and everything. That's kind of hardcore, to be honest with you. Yeah. You guys are, you guys are heroes, too. You know that, right? I've seen one, I think it was, like, a lord of this one guy, like, this one boy or whatever, was just, like, playing on his, playing on his tricycle or something. 
around the corner, and then like freaking another dog came over and started trying to bite him and attack him, and then one of the cats just ran through and just you know <laughs> swiped in front of the dog. Mm-hmm. And he got put down eventually because you know. Yeah, you can't have dying a dog like that. You can't have a dog that like. I was asking uh, me and Uh why even put dogs on fucking muzzles? I don't think you should. Yeah, because if they bite people, you have to put them down. So why even put the bo- the fucking muzzle on them if they're gonna bite people? Just put them down. Yeah, From what I remember, Susan has never bit me ever. Does Susan wear a muzzle? No. Susan exactly. Not. Okay, cool. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, she's all bark and no bite anyway. Bark is different. Bark is different. I'm talking about where they bite people, they need a muzzle. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay, the dog bites people? You need to put that fucker down. Like that Scottish Terrier around the corner of my house? Yeah. On Longdale? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That one. That one yeah. The one that bit me? Twice. He bit you twice. Yeah, twice. The other, the other time I was walking to the library to drop off some books, and then he got out and started running towards me. Oh, he like, got out? I guess he got out. Just step on him. That's the thing. It's his. It's my life or his life, and I'm not leaving this earth. Yeah, all right. So, step out and walk away. No, I'm not. I'm not saying. You know, I'm not saying like take an act of violence against them. It's defend yourself. Yeah, you that's the whole thing. Stand your ground, human. Yeah. Act like you have some testicular fortitude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Act like a human. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get bit for no reason. Hey, bark, bark. <laughs> uh, yeah. You're gonna lay down right here? Yeah. Okay. I'm laying here. Oh, you wanna lay on my lap? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So what's the what's the whole makeup of your guys' like relationship or whatever you're doing? Mm-hmm. Or I don't know, I mean like, you know, what's what's on lim- what's what's fair game, what's off limits? What's off limits in our relationship? Yeah, yeah. But stuff. Oh damn! No, I'm kidding. I'm just kidding. Just joking. See me. That's the only way I've ever enjoyed it is through you know butt stuff. But we're PVP. Player versus player. <laughs> what? Player versus player. We're not an MMO. We're not a. We're not a massive multiplayer online. We're not MOBAs. No, we're not MOBAs. Multiplayer, what does MMO stand for? M- massive Online Battle Arenas? Something like that. I don't know. LGBTQ? What's that? A sandwich? <laughs> lettuce and bacon, lettuce, tomatoes. And... Bacon, lettuce, tomato, gay! Gay. What's the A? Avocado. <laughs> And we're not making fun of that community. Right? I am. It's just, you know, it's just all good. I'm totally making fun of that community. Send me hate mail. That's the crazy part, too. It's like, oh, yeah, well, you know, that's my dad name. You can't really, you know, it's like, you don't just, you don't just change genders and then... Dude, that person hide their gender because they didn't want people to know they're a sexual predator. Yeah, you, you can't just, you can't just, you can't just hide behind... Can't be like, oh, I transitioned. That's that was me a long time ago. I'm not like that now anymore. It's just you can't, you know, you can't just change. Once a sex offender, always a sex offender. You can't, you can't change a, a literal sex, and then expect a free pass on. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, no, of course yeah. not. No, because I mean, even if it's a dead name, that follows you wherever you go. Yeah, right. It's, it's so, your fucking name. Yeah. So, and obviously that made someone uncomfortable. So. You know, I apologized in the past, but see, if I had known all that, I would have, you know, I would have flat out never brought her here. Point blank, period. Okay. I put a, uh, uh, not necessarily a put your money where your mouth is type deal, but I was just like, all right, bet. You said, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you said you want to hang out, then let's fucking hang out. So I yeah. gave her more than enough money to come over here and do all that. So. Yeah. They took advantage of you. Yeah, they have. Yeah, they did. I don't need I don't need dude condemning me for that, you know. No, he's not allowed here anymore. No, it's just an honest mistake. Is yeah, you know, I know it is. Nobody blames you. Yeah, nobody blames you. It's a bad, it's a bad misjudgment, like a bad misjudgment of of my character. 
you know, it's just, you know, I, I just need to vet these people a lot properly. See, she, her coming over will be a, you know, a decent thing because, yeah. you know, we were actually former roommates and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. And I know her. She likes me. I like her. Yeah. Yeah, I know her. Yeah. She has a vagina. It's even better. Right? Yeah. Ain't that right, babe? Mm-hmm. That's way better than a penis. Not to me. <laughs> Do you want a penis? No. But you like having your vagina, right? Yeah. That's way better. Yeah, it's an acquired taste. What, vagina? Yeah. It is. Uh, I mean, you know. Literally. Yeah. Once you acquire the taste, you have it. It just feels so good to, like, selflessly get it. You're definitely a giver. Absolutely. I'm like, promise you won't leave me type deal. How pathetic am I? No, no, you're not pathetic. It is pathetic. I'm just pathetic. Like, promise to never leave me. Freaking three and a half hours of this nonsense. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, It woke me up. I'm trying to sleep and everything. Yeah, it woke me up. Yeah. Yeah, I know. That was the look I was getting just. And then you really laid into her when she, once she called me fuckface. Oh, yeah, I did. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You called him a fuckface? Yeah. I said, don't fucking call him a fuckface. I'll come up and kick you out right now. Was this before or after we left Food for Less? After. Yeah, it was after when we were on our way home and everything. Yeah. The body dysphoria thing, I mean, you know, it's just... It's mental illness. Yeah, I just, I just, I just, to me, I just think, who really cares? You Why know? did everything have to be about transgenders when they were here? Oh, that? Well, it doesn't hide the fact that, you know, you've committed a crime in the past. Right, and, right, right. You right. know, it's just, you know, been lying about her age the whole time. You know, she was born in 67. 50-something years old? 57. Wow. Fifty six. Mm-hmm. But even then, you know, it's just, you know, lying about age and stuff like that. That's, you know, just trying to hide the criminal past or whatever. It's like, yeah. you know, just one Google search could find that. Right, right, right. And, you know, it's not really, I don't have to necessarily pay out of pocket for that information. That's all it's public. Free. No, that's public knowledge, you know. Yeah, it's free. Yeah, it's like, you know, it's just all public knowledge, so. I just told her flat out I cannot in good conscience, in good conscience, like, you know, have anything to do with you. Right. You know, Kai Sinat was crying on stream. Who's that? Kai Sinat, he's actually like a, he's actually a streamer. I think he's from New York City. Okay. I think at one point in time, I think in, in the city of New York, he was arrested for inciting a riot. Okay. And that's how big of a following that he's gained as a live as a live streamer. You know, mm. he probably does like in real life stuff or whatever. Mm. He's regularly he's regularly been hanging out with uh with uh Kevin Hart and you know Ice Spice and all of them. You okay. know, so you know a lot of those celebrities that come through. Nicki Minaj has come on to come onto a stream before. Mm. He actually had to fire one of his associates and his cameraman because apparently they you know. Because again, they're probably messaging a minor. Oh no. And that's why he was crying, because, you know, as a creator and as an influencer, this is, you know, the harsh decisions he needs to make. It's like, do I keep you on and ruin my career, or do I... Let you go and cut it off? Yeah, just cut you off completely, and that's yeah. what he needed to do. He had to make that hard decision, he was obviously crying on stream because of it. Yeah. I respect Kai. For that decision, because it's, you know... There's too many pedophiles in this world, man. Certified lover boy, certified Certified. pedophile. Wap, 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 wap. Stop fucking up. Wap, 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 wap. Tron will do his stuff. Did I say Tron? (laughs) I said Tron. I used to do my stuff. That's my, uh, that's what I used to go by when I was a kid. What, Tron? No, L-Tron. L-Tron? L-Tron, yeah. Off of, uh, off of Deltron 3030. What? Are you unfamiliar with that group? No. Dan, the automator kid, Koala, and Del, the funky homo sapien. 
Deltron 3030. Yo, what's 3030? I watch all the me Deltron Zero Hero. Not no small feat. Nope. You ever heard of that album before? Nope. That album's a freaking classic. I gotta play it track by track because that's how, that's how iconic that is. Freaking love Del. Actually, Del is what got me into rapping. Really? You know? Yeah. Deltron, Thunder Force, ain't no other source of sunlight to ton. Mike, leave your tongue tied, running them up with technology with no apology. Shout it out to my colony with third eye physiology. Mm. <sighs> yeah, that's what got me into wanting to rap. I've been doing it for a while. I need to take my meds. Damn, I don't have my meds. I need to take my meds. Did you take your meds? Yeah. You did? I gotta leave like around five or six. Okay, we have time to nap then. Yeah. So, according to a lot of these Lego games, right? Uh, what? According to a lot of these Lego games? Yeah. Lego games aren't canon. To what? For instance, the Portal series on Lego was not canon. Let me tell you why. Cave Johnson was in the personality core. What? Huh? But if you get the Steam Deck, you get the free official game, Aperture Desk Job. That's made by Valve, the same people that make the Steam Deck. And it proves that Cave Johnson is actually in a giant computerized head. And he's indestructible. So wait, non-canon? Non-canon. Okay, fair enough. I gotta change my shirt. Or just head back and shower, really. Right now? No, like when I leave. Oh, when we leave. Yeah. What, 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 Let me be your cushion. You want a pillow, Magnus? Yes. You want a pillow? Pillow, yes. You gotta wash your hair, honey. Just like you do when you wash your hair. You gotta sweat and grease and that. Y'all gonna shower together or what? I don't know, are we? Pretty sure she'll shower alone. I don't know. See me, I got nothing to hide, personally, so. Yeah, I know you don't. You're a good guy, Larry. One of the few. What? One of the few. The few, the proud, the marine. <laughs> Good day, Viva. You're making your arms dirty. No, do you mean, like, do you mean in the context it's of, just you know? cheap metal. Yeah, I just... It's like it's uh, dark bleeding right here. Yeah. That's from the cheap metal rubbing on your skin. That's why it's turning it green. Mm. Mm. Sense? Is that mine or Ambrose? No, this is Kelly. Okay, alright. Yeah. I gave it to Kelly. So maybe that's why she left it behind. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's why she left it behind. Left behind what? Weren't you sleeping and then you found it like on the floor or something? No. I don't know. Yeah, it's gonna be hot in this room. Yeah, it is pretty hot. You want me to open the window? Uh. AC? Uh, like later, when I get out. No, I mean like in the in the context of you know the fact that you know when I go to pick her up and bring her over there, what do we do? Do we just you know? Why don't you come here? Huh? Why don't you come here? That's what I'm saying. I'll bring her over here. Yeah, today, right? Thursday. No, you're not there. I can't do. I can't do today. Okay. Because if I go all the way out there, mm -hmm. or if she gets picked up by Midas, and then I have to call all the way back. Uh, you keep in mind, it takes probably, well, it takes me like, it takes me like three different, it took me like, a train and two buses to get there. Uh -huh. 
Chula Vista? Yeah. Where, where, how far away is Chula Vista? North? South. South? Yeah. But south is Mexico. So we're in El Cajon, right? San Diego, but okay. San Diego. Yeah, south. South of San Diego is Mexico. Okay, but like if we're talking like in terms of okay, so specifically. Oh, you is, mean subsidies? This is El Cajon, right? Yeah, subsidies. Uh, this is El Cajon, so I have yeah. to take I have to take the I have to take the train from El Cajon to Euclid. Get off on Euclid and then take a take a bus. Uh, international city, and then I walk like a block, take the other bus, and meet her at Burger King. Wow. And then on top of that, plus I need to give her the money for, you know, her fare. So you need to stop by your house. To go pick up my, to go pick up my change, yeah. Yeah. And then from, so, I have to go pick up my change, and then from there I'll just, you know, mm. take a bus, get on the Orange Line to Euclid, and then, mm. you know, and then I gotta pay for that to, for her bus fare, so I'll take her, you know, that bus, and then the other bus, and then take it to El Cajon, and then take that over. You don't think that's in the, like too much though? That's a lot. That is a lot. That is a lot. Show you how much I truly care about this woman. Yeah, I know you do. I do. Mm -hmm. Absolutely do. I think she's all that in a bag of chips. Yeah, you do like her a lot. Yeah. That was the most awkward part too. It's like, what am I going to do? Like, even if I wanted to go in there, I can't really go in there because, you know, the roommate will just walk right in. You're like, well, I'm telling. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Huh? You do what? Use that room. That's what I'm saying. That's, yeah, what, yeah. that's what I'm planning on doing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Welcome to Section 8 Whorehouse. How long will you be staying? <laughs> I'm going to have to talk to the doctor about action, uh, action needs because that's going to, you know. Please do. Gonna, it's Please gonna, do. It's gonna help me in a huge way. They'll give you section eight. They'll give you rent. Do you think they'll cover what I owe? No. Good. But However. they'll cover what your rent is, mm -hmm. and you can pay off what you owe easier. Yeah. Yeah. So they'll hold you down and you pay off your debt. So overall, it's going to be more beneficial to me in more ways than one. In more ways than one, yes. More ways than one, yes. Actually, it's going to be the best thing for you. Yeah, it should be the best thing for me. Yeah, it'll be the best thing for you. My feet aren't in the camera, are they? No, they're not in the shot. Cool. I just ask that you do your best to stay off the... Stay off it. Stay off your feet. Yes. As long as possible. No, yeah. You saw how bad they are. Yeah. And I have to go walking with my mom and my little brother. It's going to be even worse. Mm -hmm. For a couple days. They plan on doing a lot of shit. Okay. I mean, so what, are, what exactly are they planning on doing, you know? The beach and shopping and a lot. Okay. They're, they're planning on that. So I can, I can take it for like a day though, right? Yeah. Yeah. You want to stay another day? I'll just be here long enough to meet your mother and mm -hmm. your brother. All right. I'll just be on my way out. All right. Yeah. So you'll stay till Tuesday? Yeah. I'll, I'll try doing that. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Then I got to go home and take my meds and then shower yeah. and then get everything ready. And then on yeah. Thursday, I'm going to go pick her up and then mm -hmm. bring her over here. How am I going to get her up there though? Is what I'm asking. Up where? Up here? Yeah. She can climb stairs, can't she? I mean, yeah, sure. Okay, yeah, just follow behind her so she doesn't fall. Yeah. Just lift up her big booty. What? That's, that's the sound you make when you fall on your butt. No, I'm just saying, like, do I just, you know, do I lift her up or how does that work? No, just hold behind her and make sure she doesn't fall backwards. Okay. Yeah. Be her rock. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Talking about exclusivity or something. I just go, ha! Ha! 
exclusivity. It's like I want you to, I want you to myself and nobody. I want anyone else. I don't want to share you with anyone or whatever. She goes, stay the fuck away from her. Meanwhile, he's all grabbing a titty. Yeah. Yeah. I just said I'm not. You know. I guess they had a falling out, and then I was just like, and then they were talking about like, oh, do you wear a drug pusher? And I was like, drug pusher? Now drug I definitely pusher. don't want to be here. <laughs> I was like, drug pusher, drug dealer. I definitely don't want to be here now because you know it's. Want to get involved in that? I think Leon's pushing drugs. Okay. I think he is. He, How else, he doesn't work. How else did he get that thousand dollars? Probably a drug deal. A drug deal. That's what I'm thinking. That could be a. And he's already been pissing dirty for his parole officer. Your foot's in the shot again. I'm sorry. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. I got I got banned on Facebook one time. Because your feet pics showed. No, I took a picture of my shoes and I just said, you know, DM me for feet pics. And then all of a sudden, bam, I got blocked. I like banned out of the blue. I couldn't be, I couldn't post for like 30 days. And I was like, how is it the breastfeeding videos are totally okay, but one picture of my shoe is more than enough to get me banned? For feet pics. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, and obviously it's like, you know, it's an error. We made a mistake. I was like, fuck, you're fucking right. You made a mistake. You know, and I don't usually post nudes or anything. I only post nudes when, you know, significant others or whoever wants to, you know. There, you said nudes. Yeah, I mean, I did. Uh, I don't necessarily send my pipe unless, you know, they're really requesting it, you know. Money-wise, of course, it's a business transaction, you know. You don't get the pipe unless you write. <laughs> I don't get the pipe unless. Because <laughs> I ain't got no type. They call me Super Mario the way I lay that pipe. Hmm. <laughs> How much time we got? Seven and a half minutes. Why are you left? Are you counting out the clock? No, you were like, you paused to look at the time, so I asked. Well, according to your kitchen, it's 144, right? Yeah. Like seven and a half minutes. Okay. We'll probably get to like an hour and then be done with it. Okay. Then y'all can go to sleep and then probably, you know. You're gonna nap too, yeah? Yeah, I don't have a choice, right? Okay. I gotta kick it here until. <laughs> so are my clean clothes, are they they're in there or? Yeah, they're in the dryer. Oh, okay. All yeah. right. Okay. Yeah, help yourself to them. Yeah. It's yours. I'm gonna take my shirt off and then just fall asleep. Look okay. how hot it is out there. Yeah. It's very warm out there. Very yeah, warm out there. So, it's hard out here for a pimp trying to get that money for the lamp. Yeah, so no uh no new videos until Tuesday, I guess. Me and your mother and then I gotta ski daddle. Yeah. I have to get some sleep because, you know, she's over here complaining about how there was bugs or something at her place. Really? Yeah. Yeah. And I was just like, well, you know, the best part is you could just come over here and sleep. Yeah. Why do you think I come over here all the time? Yeah. I've been over here every other day now because yeah. on, a, on account of, you know, yeah. there's no bugs or there's no, you know, roaches or anything else that are, you know. I try to keep it clean. No mosquitoes. Whenever I see a roach, I kill it immediately on the spot. And if I don't find it, Veronica kills it. Yeah. Without the mosquitoes, I'll be fun too. There's no mosquitoes here. At the place, there is mosquitoes. Oh, your place? Yeah. Yeah. Just because of how warm it's getting over yeah, there. Yeah. yeah. Just, and you know. humid. And you got those chickens and shit. Yeah. Yeah. That's the other weird part too. It's like, how are you going to become a neighborhood yeah. snitch and all that if, you know. When your backyard is, you know, a fucking felony. When you got chickens everywhere, pretty much, you know. Now, if you wanted cock, all you had to do was ask me. But <laughs> I'm kidding. Barry, okay. Barry McCockner. Yeah, Barry, Barry McCockner. <laughs> it's Hugh, Hugh Janus. <laughs> Is there a Hugh Jazz? Hugh Jazz. Listen, I'm gonna strangle you. Put you in. Put you in cement shoes when I'm done with you. <laughs> I 
No, I kid you not. I, I swear up and down that's Karen. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I think it is Karen. Mm -hmm. The same woman that's like, oh, well, you know, they're doing this, that, and they're smoking pot, and they're doing a bunch of crazy stuff over there. You know? Mm -hmm. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Like I said, Karen doesn't like me, but I definitely like when she walks, when she walks to the back for smoke breaks. Mm -hmm. Her elephantitis of the foot. <laughs> just waltzing around, you know, it's just I saw that she wasn't really wearing a bra, and I was like, oh, okay, all right. Okay. You know, I'm an equal opportunity lover. So, Drake's a pedophile. He literally said, I fucked a girl I used to babysit. He literally said that. Well, that thing where he kissed a fan on a concert live? Yeah. There's actual video we could definitely pull. A minor. <laughs> Probably a minor. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just glad that all these people are finally being put out forward there. Right. You know? Right. That all, you know, all those, all those monsters are, you know, are made public. Yeah, because it's not okay whatsoever. Nobody's safe. Nobody's safe. That's good. No yeah. on these streets. Maybe Corey Feldman was right all along. Who's Corey Feldman? Corey Feldman, he's a child star. Primarily known for, you know, he's remembered for like the Goonies and uh, Stand By Me. Was he in the Lost Boys? No, that was, that was Kiefer. Kiefer Sutherland, but. Yeah. Yeah, Corey Feldman was right all along, so. We need to make these people, we need to make these people uncomfortable before we put it out there, put put it out there and put it forward, you know, but, yeah, it's just, you know, it's uncomfortable. Especially when uh, Dan, Sh Dan Schneider, the well, creator for all the other sitcoms on, like, Nickelodeon, he would, like, flat out show show women porn in the workplace and everything and exposing porn to children yeah mm -hmm. if you ever saw the documentary series it's called quiet on set and i think drake actually drake bell actually breaks down crying because of how you know brian and david brian and brian and dan it's something to his mind and it messed him up and you know it traumatized him. And then of course that old school that old school tale about how, you know, about how he was definitely attached to Amanda Bynes and how and how I mean there have been different conspiracy theories about how even Jamie Lynn got pregnant and that's you know so glad that these guys are just made you know uncomfortable they deserve to be uncomfortable yeah because they they're low be in prison because they're low-key monsters as well they are monsters they deserve to be in prison when harvey weinstein got exposed and i'm, I'm like harvey oh. weinstein yeah he did yeah Whoa. he's like you want to be in pictures don't you wow i think wasn't he uh, it wasn't weinstein but it was somebody else who basically said you know and told uh uh mira sorvino you know uh the late paul sorvino's daughter mm -hmm. it's like oh you don't you know if you don't listen to a thing i say then i'll make sure you never get a, you never get a, you'll never get a chance to be in a fucking picture ever again mm. you know it's just uh just glad these monsters are finally brought to the front they're just you know we need to make them uncomfortable because yeah because yeah, yeah. i mean i'm dead set against it you're dead set against it right you know mm -hmm. what i mean yeah yeah. they know like us why do you think i sent them packing i sent them packing because yeah yeah, yeah. you yeah. know you're you're lying about your age, but in actuality, it's like, like, thirty years of it. Like it was like thirty-five years ago or something like that. It's like I don't care. It happened. Yeah. And I just I don't want anything to do with you after right, that. Right, so, right. So it's like really. I felt like she took it. I felt like she, she took. She used to take it pretty well, and then she would just start, you know, coming at me sideways for whatever reason, you know. And I'm just like, ugh. Mm. I was trying to sleep, and I was just like, I regret being nice to them. Yeah. When actually.
actuality, I mean, pretty much would have been a green light on them. So. Right, right. Thank God we didn't put hands on them. Nor would we want to. Right. Yeah, but we ultimately did the right thing yeah. when it came down to it. I'll pay you $100 to fuck off. I'll give you $100 to fuck off. I'm not gonna lie. I think Keith will actually send me a decent amount of money. Yeah? Yeah. Hopefully by then I'll just put it on debit card and then, you know. I got paid a substantial amount. Because I've paid to, for the most part, I've paid to you know, keep the account open last time. Oh, okay. So. Sorry, sweet pea. So, did you play the End Saint Trilogy? I did when I was uh, growing up. No, how far along are you now currently? I'm in, I'm playing It's About Time. Oh, okay. So you bought It's About Time. Dude, it's it's so you know, it's 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 really good. It's fine. You know, I just, you know, try to go try to go to to beat it at least, like to beat the oh, story. Beat yeah, the yeah. Game. Yeah, beat the game. Yeah. That's all I recommend cuz I'm I, I'm been uh, doing a lot of time travels. Yeah. Trials. Just, yeah, but that's you why I'm, I'm a speedrunner. Yeah, I just recommend that you beat the game because they give you more stuff. Yeah. Crash two, if you beat if you beat the game, you get the super sprint ability. Yeah. So. Yeah. yeah. Cause in Crash One they didn't have time trial. In Crash Two was the same way. Yeah. I think it was like a late edition that they did, but much more to the detriment for Are you one. about warped? No, just, I mean, in terms of warp, yeah, you know, like, the super sprint would be available, yeah, that, that would be an available power. Because I think the first one you're able to, the first one you're able to do a super, super, uh, super jump, super slam. Oh, super slam. You do a super slam and, and warp with one. Uh, uh, the second set is a double jump, third is, you know, the, the death tornado spin, fourth is the brute bazooka, and the fifth one's the super sprint. Okay. Beat the game and you get the super sprint. Yeah. <laughs> You're able to move like a lot faster. Yeah. yeah. But how far along did you get in? It's about time. <laughs> it's about time? Yeah. I'm, you uh, beat it? huh? You beat it. I'm, uh, I'm still dealing with engine, like rocket head. Oh, like that, that was an easy fight. It was, it was an easy fight, yeah. Yeah. Just boss fights in general are easy fights. Yeah. Yeah. But you haven't beat engine yet? Uh, so you're I, on the second world. I got as far. I got as far as past entropy. Entropy. Yeah. Oh, so you you're really far. Yeah, I was really far. Yeah. Okay, so how many times do you fight in Jin? You you fight him twice. Oh, okay. I only fought him once yet. Yeah, you fought him once, and then when you beat him, you can play the, the stage inverted. That gives you a trophy as well. Inverted. Yeah, inverted. Oh, yeah. yeah. That would be hard. It is very hard to do it, like, inverted, and, like, a it's... weapon of mass percussion! Yeah. yeah. I like the way he talks. Did you get, a? did you get the achievement for, you know, breaking his, uh, breaking his radio? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Quiet on side or something like that? Or something like that, you know. I freaking love the, <laughs> I love the, um, there was one, there was one achievement and trophy. Mm -hmm. For the insane trilogy, like if you you know basically if you spin away a life, mm -hmm. it just goes. I meant to do that. <laughs> Those little details. So, yeah, Crash One. I mean, obviously has time trials, but I don't really know about all that because you know it's just, it's just you know it's too much. You know, I don't do time trials for one or two because you know. That's what's needed to really like beat and fully complete the game. It's just oh, you gotta collect all all relics. I was like, nah, no thanks. No disrespect to relics. And Crash Team Racing Nitro Field, yeah, that that I could definitely see the purpose of time trials and all that. That would make sense. But you know, just in in the natural stage, I don't think a lot of those stages, like a lot of those levels, are built for that. Mm. Crash can only go one way or whatever. Meanwhile, the whole the whole clock ticks. It just keeps ticking and ticking and ticking. So I actually got a platinum on um I got a platinum on a uh, on the Orient Express. Mm. Or 
you know, one of those uh, Great Wall of China levels. Mm -hmm. Those things go by really fast. So, yeah, but then they do the, you know, the whole death tornado stand or whatever. It's just, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just, you got to do all that, and then you got to get to the developer times, and I'm just like, ah, life is too short to do all that. Yeah. Like I said, I just recommend beating the game and then getting as much of the costumes as you can before you even think about, you know, going to do the time trials right now, because, or heck, can pre-create them. I like doing the time trials first, because some of them give you, uh, skins. Like Insanity Peak, if you six diamond it, you get a skin with the unicorn horn on Coco. Oh yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's always cool. Yeah, if you get like if you get like six of those gems, then you can you know unlock skins. But... Yeah. Yeah, I recommend beating the game and you know getting the skins if need be. But outside of that, I mean, I don't, you know, it's a nightmare trying to get the platinum. I'm going to try to 100% it. Uh, was, there, was there like... Was there like a hundred and... It was like a hundred and like five percent. Oh yeah, something like that. Yeah. Because, I mean, you'll notice in Spyro, it'll be like over a hundred percent. Yeah. You know, at least over a hundred. It's like, we have like at least 12,000 gems. Or was it 14,000? Because there's an extra 2,000 that's like left behind, but you had to get everything mm -hmm. under the sun in order to unlock that nasty loot level. When I uh, when I beat the first Crash Bandicoot, yeah. I'll definitely move on to Spyro the Dragon. They have modern Spyro? Oh, they do. They have the Reignited Trilogy. Mm. Includes all three games. That's why in Insomniac, you know, Insomniac games, when they first made Ratchet and Clank, they actually gave a special thanks to Naughty Dog, because rather than actually being their rivals, they were actually like, you know, they were actually like in the same building, like kind of like teammates, kind of like working amongst each other, you know. That's cool. Doing different designs and everything. So. That's cool. Yeah. Building the world and yeah. the characters was something yeah. special. And you just said What? Because I didn't want to move my mouth. Thanks. I didn't want to squish you while I grabbed my coffee. Are you going to take it out? We are after the show. Okay. Yeah. Because it was over. Okay. It's going to be a lot of fun, though. It is. Sure is. This looks like scabies. Not that I know of, no. Okay. I'm gonna change my pants. Like I said, I don't I don't think I don't think it's scabies. Scaby pants? Maybe scaby pants. Maybe scabies. Scaby pants? Maybe scabies. Maybe scabies. Maybe scabies. Maybe scabies. Maybe scabies. Cause if it's like a dollar twenty okay, dollar twenty five there, dollar twenty five. You put a dollar twenty five and then a dollar twenty five to alcohol, and so that's so that's like at least five bucks, right? Oh, that's gonna freaking suck. Thinking about the things that we could be lately have been. <laughs> we'll be counting stars. Beefcake! You're me. Beefcake! <laughs> I'm a beefcake. I'm just big bound. I'm just big bound. <laughs> beefcake! The turk or jerk. The turk or jerk? The turk or jerk. The turk or jerk? The turk or jerk or mom and jihad. Mom and jihad. turk or jerk is mom and jihad. Okay. I know you are, Hank. Matt Damon. 
Matt Gaiman. Sounds like Matt Gaiman. Matt Damon. Yeah. Matt Damon. I love your balls. Veronica. Fuck yeah. yeah. <laughs> She's like, please, Daddy, I want to lick the juices off your fingers. Mm. Oh, blast it all. I don't go and wet myself. What is it? It's a pair of my dream. Oh, really? Yeah. I got it though. Shall we? No. <laughs> mm. I think it was my eyebrow hair. Speaking of eyebrows, you got two caterpillars growing over there. Oh, God. Don't remind me. <laughs> I saw one of those dudes with a unibrow. Oh, really? The one in Metro. Oh, yeah? He's like, hey, buddy, how's it going? I was like, hey, hey hi. Hi. <laughs> He's all got to do your ears. <laughs> it's all the bleeding like I'm this. A, I'm offensive. It's like, please come hither. And it <laughs> gestures me this way. <laughs> I didn't know your eyebrows direct in traffic. Hey. Right. Hey, buddy, how's it going? It feels hot in here. Do you feel hot? Uh, I noticed that a lot of these Middle Eastern gentlemen are actually feel like really nice, huh? You feel hot? Well, I am hot. I know I'm hot. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Do you mind refilling my water, please? Sure. Thank you. Thank you so much. There, you asked for so much. Where's your water? That bag right there. Okay. Oh, the cup? Uh, yeah, I will go out and eat, but I don't want to. I don't want to waste the freaking. Don't waste your EPD. Not, not right now. No. And dinner from the stones. We'll be counting stars. That'll be hot too. We'll be able to go to a date, like go to Wendy's or go to. Go to Wendy's or go to um or Subway. Bahama Jihad. Yeah. I think I think the whole inclusion of masks has kind of made the game like three hundred percent harder than it needed to be. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah. I like the masks though. It's good for mechanics. Those those are decent mechanics, yeah, but. You know, it's just, gosh, it's so tough. It's good mechanics, if you ask me. Yeah, those are fine. Platforming perfection. Do you mean the original crash? No. <laughs> the original crash? Oh, well, yeah, you know, I mean, because, you know. We're only here to make you, we're only here to make you go. They, they sing that song in the back, right? That's what I love too. The trailer? Oh yeah. Yeah, it was a good trailer. No time to dance. What you hear is not a... You know Q-Tip from A Trap Called Quest does that song? No, I did not. <sighs> He's just... We're only here to make you go. Go, 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 go. So I find it kind of surprising that you haven't played the Legacy of Goku trilogy. No. No. I'm not a Dragon Ball Z guy. Well, I am. I know you are. Kame! Kame! I just suck because I didn't want to find out. It's like I quit. I, know, I don't know if you could do it or not, but I'm not going to fuck around and find out. <laughs> So when can I borrow it? Because I definitely want to get into that. Borrow it? The tablet. The tablet? The tablet. The tablet. The tablet. The tablet. Not my Steam Deck. No, the tablet. The what tablet. What about it? I can use it. Yeah, it's yours. I want to get down on Legacy of Goku too. Okay. That's arguably my favorite. Okay. The first one is a huge mess because it's so ball-bustingly difficult. Yeah. So on one hand you're trying to heal, <laughs> yeah. while these while these animals they hit you like trucks, dude. Yeah. And it's it's insane that they do. Yeah, that's why I just you know, there's actually a code for the the first legacy of Goku. If you go up down left right uh, up down left right B A, you're invincible. 
that's what I do to that's what I use to get get through that game in a heartbeat because you know it's just yeah okay. I don't necessarily hit 25 but like I just you know I just I I just love to like skip past it completely and just be done with it. Yeah, Legacy of Goku 2 is just like a way better game. Okay. Right. Right. I got it on, I got it in 2000, was it 2002 or 2003? Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. I, I bought the freaking, I bought the holographic box that it came in. Oh, nice. Yeah, it was beautiful. It was fantastic. It was great. This is great, baby. This is great, baby. This is great. This is good news, baby. I just think it's a better game overall. <laughs> She's up and leaving all of a sudden. She's like, to hell with you and your hot takes. I don't... <laughs> what? In my house? What? What? Is that what you said? No. <laughs> I thought she was getting off the couch. She's like, that's it. His hot takes. I can't take it anymore. No. <laughs> Honey. Yeah. Come sit in the AC with me. Not so good. Aww. I'm comfy. Aww. Her name's Social. Annie Social. Annie Social. You know, that's a wrestler name. No. Yeah. Annie Social. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's a pro wrestler. She was primarily known as being one of one of the main no one of the one of the main characters on uh what was that uh what? what was uh what was that uh the NWWL? NWWL? Yeah, the Naked Women's Wrestling League. Really? Yeah, really, that really. Thing. Yeah, that is a thing. I think it's like, I think it's in Vegas, probably. Power bomb! Another power bomb! A third power bomb! He's making a left turn. <laughs> He's making a left turn! He's making another left turn! He's making another left turn! Computer, take me out of this. Hmm? I'm just saying, computer, take me out of this. You'll definitely want to start getting ready if you don't mind. The, the tablet doesn't work when the remote is working. Okay. So, you want me to do it? Uh, yeah. yeah. What are you trying to do? If you know how to do that. What are you trying to do? Set it to a uh, Legacy of Goku 2. Yeah. Okay. Through my boy. My boy, my boy, talking about my boy. Battery might be low on this thing. I'd imagine. Play so many games on it. Yeah, I think Legacy of Goku 2 is definitely a lot of fun. I enjoyed playing that a lot. So. We got yeah, the battery's dead on this thing, so it's not working. We gotta charge it. I got a supercharger. Luckily for you, I got the... I have a supercharger right here. I got the two prong ones. No, I got a supercharger right here. I was like, whoa, cool, double penetration. I know you're blind, but you gotta see this. Thinking about the things that we could be lately have been in the stars. Got us with the gun stars. Well, kids, it was fun while it lasted. No, that's yours. Oh, I know that. Yeah, I don't need to use it, though. Okay. Yeah, I don't need to use it. Anyway. I, uh, I'm do, you really, do you really eat the booty like groceries? No. Oh, you don't? No, I don't. She might throw up on you. It's okay, Mama. Just let it out. I'll clean it. Will it land on your bag? No matter where it lands, I'll clean it. All right, should we take naps? Yeah. For what? Because it's been over an hour. Yeah, we're like 10 minutes. Okay. And then we'll be packing it up like a U-Haul truck. You leaving? No. Oh, packing it up. No, I'm not doing that. I'm probably going to get some sleep. Yeah. Sure, I'm going to get some sleep too.
That's the deal. I don't usually have sex with people. I just make love. Okay. That's what I do. Okay. That's what I do now. I don't make love. I have sex. Making love takes too long. Takes way too long. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Baby. Shark dude 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 dude. <laughs> I'm playing. I gotta clean this place before my mom gets here. Kelly said she will help me. Yeah. We're gonna do it Monday. So it's nice and fresh to clean. I just wish it was Sunday. Mm. Cause that's not a fun day. Fun dip. You ever had fun dip? Me? Yeah. 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 I used to have fun dip when I was a kid. So there's this rumor that apparently drinking cola gives like tastes like battery acid. Who drinks battery acid? No, well, that's what I'm saying. It does. It's akin to that. It, was just like, it doesn't taste like battery acid. Oh, yeah, well, there you go. See exactly. It says something about something about it. Don't wanna talk about. It. I don't know what it is, I just get like cold feet sometimes, so, mm -hmm. I don't know, it's like when it comes to like meeting folks and everything, it's mm -hmm. just, you know, I get kind of like weary of people sometimes. Mm -hmm. Hi, sweet pea. This phone. It gives it the back of your head like that? Mm hmm. Okay. So when we come over on Thursday, do we mm -hmm. just flip the thing over? Or? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We'll do it that way. So, according to this new Mortal Kombat, you know, Chaos Reigns, mm -hmm. that, that story expansion and everything, yeah. I'll get the, the different combat packs or whatever, because just as they dropped Akita, they automatically announced, you know, Noob Cybot, Cyrax Sector, and then you got Ghostface, Conan the Barbarian, and the T-1000. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I'm happy that Robert Patrick's going to be a part of that, but... Mm -hmm. I don't think, I don't think they have, I mean, I just, my question is, like, why why can't Arnold get into the booth? Just He's too expensive. Is he too expensive? He's way too expensive. Absolutely. Hello, nice to meet you. I'm the governor. Yeah, but I mean, Sylvester Stallone returned his Rambo. That was definitely a cool yeah, detail. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, yeah, that is a great detail. I don't know, maybe he's, maybe he is too expensive. No, I just feel like. There's a different side of Arnold, like, he could be, he could be, you know, he could be, like, this gruff action guy, or he could be, like, he could be twins, Arnold twins, you know, his thing, you know, kindergarten cop, it is not a tumor, Ooh. I just love, uh, I just love, uh, I love Arnold and his films, yeah. even Jingle All the Way, I enjoy Jingle All the Way, yeah, because Arnold's in it, yeah, because, you know, Yeah, 
yeah, these these people who go into strokes and do stuff like that, they should just really like get into voice acting. Mm. You know. Yeah. Because wasn't wasn't Tim Curry Emperor Deviculus and uh, Brutal Legend? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Tim Curry's in that. And I think Sinbad just had a stroke. Mm. So yeah. He either showed up like in a cane or like on a, in a wheelchair, you know. Mm. You know. And, uh, you know, it's, it's always sad. Plus the whole deal with, um, I think Richard Simmons actually, you know, said no, he doesn't want to be portrayed, like, he, do, he doesn't want Polly Shore to portray him in a biopic. Mm -hmm. And then Richard Simmons passes. So, I don't know if they're going to move forward with that biopic and stuff, but, mm. yeah. Yeah. I mean, part of that, you know, for me, though, fan service is fan service, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. If they're like, oh, yeah, you know, you, you did this great, and we want you to return to do this, and again, and I was just like, okay, cool. Make memorable characters or something. Mm -hmm. At least try to. I write decent characters, but, it, you know, it only takes a certain individual to really bring that character out mm -hmm. to life. Yeah. You know, in other cases, yeah, so. You know, like I said, I'm a great and talented writer, but, you know. I mean, if people want me to return, I will, you know, if given the opportunity. Hell, I, I could even do voice acting. Did you know I was actually going to be one of the legends in Apex Legends? What? Really? Yeah, absolutely. Really? Yeah. Arcade, and I got, like, freaking, you know, a gaming backpack or whatever. Mm -hmm. A lot of the skins in the backpacks or whatever are basically going to be, you know, in one of those deals. Mm -hmm. It's going to be cool, you know. Those are always, you know, those are always cool. Yeah. Yeah. Hell, if I get a skin in Fortnite, mm -hmm. that's it. That's all. That's it for me. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. It'd be really cool to, like, it'd be really cool, like, like for back bling, to just, you know, back up. Rock one of these bad boys. Yeah. Them, you know what I mean? Yeah. Those are always cool. You know? Hell, I could freaking, uh, I could freaking be in the new, uh, even the new NBA Street video game. There you go. When they're going to finally release that, it's going to be like NBA, NBA Street Rebounds. Mm -hmm. With a Z on the end, so we know what we're saying. <laughs> yeah. This remastered cut yeah. <clears throat> comes off as a bit generic because it goes remastered. Mm -hmm. And then Red Faction Gorilla, it's remastered, which mm -hmm. is weird because I'm just like, I don't know. Maybe those things are fun. Mm -hmm. Like Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Mm -hmm. That's fun. I'll definitely be doing that for the channel eventually. Yeah, that is fun. Yeah, because there's like a really confusing puzzle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it just makes just makes skin 100% a nightmare. So, anything you want to plug or any final you know final thoughts or whatever? I love you, family. Okay, lots of love and respect to you guys. I'm looking forward to dog pull. Mm. Looking forward to seeing uh to seeing uh Electra, Gambit, and Blade show up in that movie too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I feel like it's kind of weird though, cause like wasn't at one point in time wasn't Andrew Garfield like, oh no, I'm definitely not gonna be in the new Spider Man. And the next mm -hmm. thing you know, he was in No Way Home as well. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, I won't spoil No Way Home, even though I should, cause it's been over what what four years. Right. No, it's been over three or four years. I was like, I'm not gonna spoil No Way Home because it was that good of a movie. Yeah. But all the villains made their made their return. You know, yeah. all the ones that mattered returned. Yeah. 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 Even Jamie Foxx. I like Jamie Foxx and all the Amazing Spider-Man too. I like uh, the guy with the fishbowl head. Who Mysterio? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was uh that was Far From Home, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Jake Gyllenhaal, yeah, that was that was him, wasn't it? Mm. Mysterio. That one's crazy too, because I mean, spoilers if you didn't see Far From Home, but the whole time was just you know him and a huge marketing PR team basically like you know creating the illusion that he was a hero, mm -hmm. you know. So, and then of course J. John Jameson still you know freaking J. K. Simmons still being J. J. Jameson. Mm -hmm. Being like, 
It's like, I didn't ask for no nudes. I want pictures of Spider-Man, damn it. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I like them legacy characters. There's one and only. Yeah, classic characters. Classic characters. Definitely, like, looking forward to seeing Scorpion. Mm-hmm. Like, the Scorpion mm-hmm. in the movies. Yeah. Hell yeah, I do want to see McDonald Gark in it. He played a uh, he played Spider Man for the PlayStation One. Mm-hmm. I played it for PC when I was in middle school. Mm-hmm. Greetings, true believers, and that narration by Stan Lee that's uh, that's iconic. That's fantastic. So when you talk about Lego games itself being like mm-hmm. non canon, yeah. But what about the Lego Movie or Lego Movie Two? Lego movie and Lego 2 is canon. Yeah, those are canon. Yeah, yeah those are canon. I actually got the platinum for the Lego movie. Really? Yeah. Well, everything is awesome. That one hurt like a... That one was really hard. Mm-hmm. Camp Snoopy. I don't know what it is with tap water with me. You know, it's mm-hmm. like it's fine, but it's kind of like the hand job of cereal. Mm-hmm. It's like the hand job of drinks, you know? Mm-hmm. This is good, but you know what I really want. <laughs> Let me know when this stuff's fully charged because I definitely want to come back to playing. Uh, I definitely want to come back to playing Legacy Joker too. Okay. After the show, you want to charge the iPad too? Oh, the tablet. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I just I don't want Apple coming at me with cease and desist orders, being like, "Oh yeah, you don't understand. I got to pay seventy five thousand dollars." I was like, right. "I'm not doing all that." Right, right. I use a broke boy. No, if you go to like Mobile Pro, I think they'll probably repair it for like they'll probably get you like a different screen for like. Maybe 50 bucks. Or like $10 or something. Since he's falling asleep, and I guess everyone else is, so. Yeah, sorry. To that, I say a good fight, good night. Good night. Game over.